We are back now with She Made It, and this one really sounds counterintuitive. A fashion brand that actually wants you to buy fewer things. Today, lifestyle and commerce contributor Jill Martin Brooks is here to explain. Yes. Tell me more. No. Th this has been my mantra all along. Yeah. Less is more. Only have things that are a 10, the I best of the best. I all think right. of that all the time. When you go yes. through things, when you try to sort through <laughs> things? Try. Okay, so I met up with the founders of Kuyana, whose less is more approach has helped grow their company into a celebrity favorite and inspire women to value the simpler things in life. We really do believe that the love is in that product. We want women to feel like their best selves. Carla Gallardo and Shilpa Shah are on a mission to change how people consume fashion by buying less. We have a little Kuyana love for you. Yeah. Aww. Their philosophy of fewer better sparked the idea for their fashion and lifestyle brand, Kuyana. The mantra for your company is what I've preached. I'd rather you have 20 amazing items in your closet than 200 items. When we feel confident, we are unstoppable. When we are wearing the right pieces, we feel elegant, sophisticated. So that's what Kuyana is about. It's providing those products to women like us so that we can win in our day today. In 2009, a serendipitous meeting in business school brought the two of them together, where they both realized they had similar upbringings and shared values. I look back at my home and it was a fewer better home from Ecuador and we were very uh, selective in what we purchased. And it was really because we didn't have a lot of options. And when I came to America for college, I realized I changed really fast. I had actually started to buy uh, in a more frugalist way than I had ever purchased before. But I really felt actually my closet was empty. And so even though there was more, there was actually less. And I realized that there was a better way to sell to customers. Carla and Shilpa aim to fix that problem by working on a sustainable fashion brand focused on premium quality and traditional craftsmanship. We created Jill a supply chain of the best materials of the world. Boquilla straw hats in Ecuador, baby alpaca in Peru, leather travel cases in Argentina. We really believe that if you put the investment in, you're gonna get that value out. And for us, at the very beginning, it was about making products that women could wear every, every single day. And Carla and I didn't find that in the market, so we set out to make a brand that could deliver that. So in 2011, with the help from both families, they launched Kuyana by selling hats, then scarves, and seeing the same customers coming back for more. What we are building with our customer is the connection that is so strong that she is buying fewer, but she is buying more of Kuyana. Shortly after launching, the pair ran into challenges raising money from investors until they turned to social media. You actually found your first investor through Pinterest. I mean, at the time, nobody was talking about how few female partners there were in venture capital firms. It was the early days of Pinterest. Someone had pinned every um, female investor partner in the U.S. I think there was, was nine the or ten um, total at the time. And so Carla and I were like, you know what? We're going to pitch all ten of these women. It worked. Since pinning down their first investor in 2012, Kuyana has raised more than $30 million in capital. Today, Kuyana can be found in six retail locations across the country, expanding their collection to clothing and bags and quickly growing into a celebrity favorite. Is it still a pinch me moment? A hundred percent. The first time we saw a celebrity uh, wearing our bags, I mean, pinch me moment. The first time I saw a person that I didn't know right. on the street was a pinch me moment. Carla would call me every time. <laughs> In the early days, she'd be like, somebody we didn't know bought from yes. us. And then <laughs> I'd be mean, like, and then I would have to be like, oh, that's my friend. I'm yeah. sorry. <laughs> you know? So what would your advice be for female entrepreneurs who have a unique idea? For us, it's really about if you have those fundamental, that fundamental passion as to why you're building something, hold that sacred and don't compromise. They're amazing. And We're Kuyana started with this hat. Oh, wow. This has been known to us as the Panama hat, but I learned oh. these hats are actually hand-woven in Ecuador. So the oh. Kuyana founders have been on a mission to change the name of the hat to reflect where it comes from. And all of the products are intentionally designed to maximize wears over time, like mm -hmm. we discussed, mm -hmm. like this travel tote that you can even personalize, which oh. they made for me with oh. my new initials. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.